when i want to uh, get a uh, full article based on the reference you should apply to the particular journal then they will send us uh, com complete profile of the our article either by post or they send later on they send to the email this is thing happens so that is called as closed access only can view this abstract but full paper cannot be viewed or read by or you can even download also later stage they uh, admit to download the articles by paying the prescribed amount of fees then another cases so called as uh, open access Open access has a lot of advantages. At the same time, have its own limitations. We uh, see one by one. In the case of which they have those open access resources. It's uh, free to all. Anyone, ever, uh, anywhere, you can open and you can see the articles through online. Uh, maybe it may not be available as uh, offline. Even we are not interested now. Also, that is a different issue. Once there is an open access, we are paying the uh, person who is publishing the article. Either may uh, fees for maintenance the server, uh, etc., etc. and uh, some other cases uh, in a organization which they run the journal they may not get, collect the fees so they are will getting you free of cost they but they themselves they giving this open access uh, permission they will ask will go for publishing the article in a reputed journal they will ask whether it is it should be a closed access or open access if uh, an article has to be viewed by many people and citations needed then you can uh, give this select as a uh, open access otherwise you can go for this closed access okay in the case of open access resource it is free to all but they are charging in nowadays almost all journals are fixing the price for charging here for this uh, maybe it starts from 1000 or 2000 or maybe it will go up to 1.52 lakhs so okay this is a case about so one the second point it gives us a readership has been opened number anyone can download or view the article and they can read the content so the author readers has been increased tremendously but the quality control of the article has been got diminished because nowadays the number of journals daily the, the many minimum 10 to 20 journals will bombs in your uh, mail box saying that you can uh, submit your article in our journal etc etc so the what happens the quality has been got declined <coughs> third thing the access of for the researchers in the developing countries the access of kind of developing countries is a vital thing because they may not able to afford the high price to get the article or a journal so in that aspect that is good one but the sustainability of the particular journal is a big question mark for example we are somebody is opening a running a journal for a limited period of time later they may not able to maintain the server fees etc then immediately all of a sudden they may withdraw from the, the close the journal then what happens the sustainability of the journal becomes a issue the people those have really published the article in the particular journal <coughs> may not able to view later even the citation will become zero so this is the like issues what happen in the case of this open access journals then the open access journals have gives a number of solutions because if you need read number of journals or articles you can find out this keys what are the points has been there and we can solve the issues what are the methodologies they adopted to solve the issues you can adapt it and solve the issues come to collaborative work you can uh, not only you doing the collaborative work within your department you can do intra department or uh, inter state or inter, you know uh, other countries with who are it may be the, those who are reading the article with the based on this corresponding author by giving the mail they can do collaborative work some people may do uh, work some people will do the in, uh, investigations some will go for the interpretation and some will do the statistical analysis so all people together they'll give their own input so that the quality of the article becomes good one so this is like say about us collaborative work next come this peer to peer sharing of scholarly information so if we include this websites institutional repositories preprint services open access journals or dedicated platforms what are the person to person directly you can able to share the article or share the work work environment what about nature requirement all the things you can able to post it personally so that the one to one interaction will be get improved by, and the updation of the particular research work can be done better one the next one is we go for this uh, collaborative evaluation the collaborative evaluation mainly in the case of peer reviewed journal so the peer reviewed journal means they will go for this uh, evaluation panels by with a limited number of members along with the editor board and this uh, collaborative work has to be due proper evaluation so if a running a, in an institution is running a journal they cannot give me keep it as a evaluation panel 
so the order the whoever comes as a reviewer they'll give me a send a request form so the whoever accepted that based on the scope of the journal uh, then they can be a reviewer of for a particular journal so this evaluation panel on the, all those things gives us quality metrics for a particular journal if, if the evaluation people are going through go globe then the value of the particular journal also will get boosted so the, and in this case the bias has to be minimized to minimize the bias should provide us more comprehensive assessment and a foster a culture of transparency accountability and collective decision making in an academic evaluation process then only the better decision will be getting and identified by the people and coming to this uh, research evaluation the, the dimension of research has been classified into four categories one you can say about is uh, productivity and one is uh, have visibility reputation and impact in the case of this uh, productivity how uh, the research based on the research uh, the productivity get increased tremendously and in case of visibility the the people those who are area working in the particular area can able to see your paper the who have been published the work and advance the two people are doing research work one person is publish the article means then the, that person has the authority of for a particular research work the next two people has to be can have either has to change the work or change the working area and methodology to for the novel research work so based on your work the reputation has been improved and based on that impact of the impact on the work as well as journal and the article has to get you know, improved then what are the exponential growth of the scientific literature say about as uh, the rapid disappearance before the noticed by the communities so uh, in case you know, since the number of journals number of articles has been published day by day in the online when you go for searching a particular type of journals in the google uh, the recently published article may come in the first the remaining goes down so the more number of articles has been public, uh, published in the, based on the keywords uh, has been uh, focused at the top of the thing and these things uh, there is no single database to identify or to uh, get abstract a collective idea whatever we record exactly so in this case the algorithm should be developed as software has to be designed and developed in so that so that we have to uh, identify the based on the keywords you have to find out the component and methodology adapted to be uh, analyzed and that's why it says the data mining tools have been required to identify these things so in that what are the uh, six points has been quoted over here one is called as technological advancement then increased the funding global collaboration specialization publisher perish and the open access movement i consider in all the components as the six categories the technology advancement means this online give, journals gives a preprint servers scientific database they made this research articles more accessible which has been made much facilitated a dissemination of the scientific knowledge so publishing the article in the internet gives much easier benefit for the workers or researchers a uh, funding kind of funding case the either private institutions or government or industries who are giving funds even our pc has been proposed to have to be give a fund for the researchers so in these people will go for this based on their novel research or projects and based on their publications only so based on publication when the funding has been given the work will be get published maximum in the particular research area then when you come to the global collaboration when you go for this international travel made the easier to the researchers to collaborate across the borders which increased the collaboration not only in the panel research in the articles which has been published so the different countries and institution making the collaboration between them and they are publishing the work throughout the globe when it comes to the specialization when it has been specialized in a particular area the researcher has been focusing on a specific research area based on that result we can able to go finding a specific topic or area where they can find and grow better so the special basically there is there the minimum number of publications or no publication has been done that area the researchers has been identified means they can flourish better because whenever they doing any one perform the work and do the citations they'll quote the same people articles forever that is the advantage of it then the next one is publish or perish so here it is that says either publish or perish or go for filing a patent so in the case nowadays people are going for this uh, publishing the article as the maximum because 
these academic institutions they are forcing their employees or teachers to make the publications every year either one article or two article or five articles the limitation has been fixed higher so whenever they do the work they'll do such a minimum or similar type of works and they'll publish in the journals so because of the under pressure condition to get the say the uh, acceptance from the institution or uh, we had to uh, getting a funding from the other organization or for the career development career growth or recognition in that particular field the productivity has been got increased but the quality of the research really comes down next coming to the open access movement this gives us a uh, work in open access journals are depositing the preprints their posters increasing the availability and visibility of the scientific literature so whenever you go for the publishing and the article they gain the momentum and are getting free of unrestricted access through the scientific literature coming to the coming to the tools so i saying about this bibliographic record of paper the only reference management tools are freely available to the researchers worldwide so i have been uh, cited five freely available online reference managers they are manly cite you like zotero google scholar library and endnote i give this endnote basic this basic is a free software the advancement is there is a pay journal pay software so among these five only two are this desktop versions are available they are manly and zotero the remaining are this only this online management system only has been maintained from the literature and the references so when you go for scientific references the number of research literature review is a important parameter or criteria to collect the up to date knowledge before starting any one of the work or research work so it's a continuous process of the researcher till they stop their research work in their life and the amount of a quantum of research or literature available for to the senior researchers are very high because for past 10 years one person is working in the particular area of research so he may initially he may struggle to publish an article later on his own article may be recited or cited by his own area because of continuity of work then second thing the in the area of zone he may publish lot of articles all things get gathered together get this number of literature will be high so these things even keeping the literature systematically and keeping a single place to retrieval or citation in a, before publications is a very laborious work for the researcher and it also consumes more time so what the people do if you have utilizing such type of softwares and online the methodologies it can minimize the time of wastages where if you have an article or if a journal is refusing your article Are rejecting it, uh, and you are not interested to publish the same article, say, the article in the particular journal. Then what you can do? You can uh, the content is same. Only thing is the references modification has to be done in the major cases. So instead of APA model, you can go for this other uh, model methodology by selecting the thing and simply within a single click, the whole references which uh, whatever is uh, be focused or placed in the article will be changed as per wish. So that becomes very convenient. to easily send the same article to other journal within a day otherwise we have to go through the complete article here was the reference one here we given as alphabetically so it should be given as a name has to be replaced with the number and coding uh, correlating all the things even though if you do it very systematically if the references are more than 50 then you will be getting is a pathetic condition so you may not able to complete it properly because of the overload So if it is 10 or 15 literature, it is easy to just making a numbering or formatting is easy. So in the case of review article, it's very difficult. It's a tedious process. So that case, these online reference managers has been used as a better tool. So this collection of literature, whether it's a past work, it's an ongoing work, or we for future work, all the things has been cited in the proper references. <coughs> Sorry. So this literature gathered is past, ongoing, future research. in the both the past and ongoing research what are the cited references and the current citing reference also has to be noted down in a separate area as as i said earlier the five reference managers are there and these five managers have their target groups all are academicians and researchers and students these are only these three category people have been focused and is it founded in the different eras the cite like has been founded in 2004 and zotero 2006 Manly 
and enrolled at Google Scholar has been founded in 2013. Each manager they have this, their own mission, and uh, they according to this, the owner of the company has been there different. The guys of Manly elsewhere, Cytulek, which has been uh, old city, and nowadays becomes a Springer. Then uh, Zotero is the center of history and uh, new media and uh, GMU. And this uh, intro is uh, run by this Thomson Reuters. I Google Scholar, as you know, what is Google? Okay, so these things, among these two uh, machine have this desktop, as we uh, discussed earlier, elsewhere, and this Thomson Reuters, then nothing but manually, and this in note. And this Zotero is an open source component. And website is uh, given over here. And uh, Almetric uh, code, where we're focusing this more than publication of 20 articles, has been uh, given. In the case of uh, Manly and site you like only. And the case of uh, social groups, uh, except this uh, internet and Google Scholar, all the three uh, site managers can use for this uh, social groups can be created. And except Google Scholar, bookmarker can be done by in the, all the online reference managers. First, we'll discuss what is Manly. It's the most preferred online reference managers freely available to the researchers across the world. They launched in this 2007 full fledged and a record by uh, acquired by elsewhere. And it was done by this Scopus and the Science Direct. And the Manly became leading online reference manager and PDF organization in terms of popularity among the researchers and academics since it has been given as a free one. And we have these two things. Basically, we say as web uh, reference manager and desktop. First, we will go through about this uh, web research managers. And in that case, it is quick and simple installation. Just within three clicks, we can install and we can able to create our own bibliography details. And the citation styles can be changed as per you wish. Even over thousands of models can be created or modified. Quick search and selection of citation style, rapidly growing community, manage database, and create a new style with a new CS editor also is possible. And creating a bibliography instantly and cite seamlessly without leaving any word, formatting a citation's bibliography according to a selected or chosen or modified method and style can be adapted. The flexibility of formatting is more convenient in the case of this man link. And collaborate on by bibliography, when you want to share a bibliography to your colleagues, to a private group, or any member, or even you can edit or add, or your group members can add or edit or modification can be of citation reference also can be done. Next, coming to uh, desktop features, uh, you can have this, uh, hundreds of online resources by directly can be done for a uh, research purpose. You can have an open, annotated, or uh, and search the PDF files through online. And online, as and uh, you can store in your desktop. And create a bibliography in the over 5000 style, which is available in the system. And you can have like, a good access to uh, share the references to your colleagues. Access and manage your research uh, from your area where you're working. So coming to the desktop specifically, navigating the desktop interfaces and populating your library, including uh, the manly web interfaces by using this importer has been done. This is the general, I'll give this uh, outline about it. I uh, last stage, I've given this link where you can get easily accessible by the, to operate and handle this uh, managers. But I'll give a outline, uh, glimpses how to uh, create and edit and modification to create a library. So first you want to search a manly, whatever it may be, the software, you have to download. In the case of Windows means you can go for Google search and you can uh, download our applications, you can download our Mac applications, you can download and uh, install in the system. After installation only, you can do all these works. Okay, so uh, first you want to search a library in uh, things. When you open this manly, in the right uh, table, system uh, right top corner, there will be manly logo will be there. How to open it? And in that case, you can add this uh, all uh, left column, my library, whole segment has been created, all library has been there. Okay, so here the recently added. So recently added means you want to add one of the articles or create a folder means just uh, go for this uncharted, create a folder. And uh, by creating a folder, you can give uh, names. So here are uh, all articles have been there. So recently added means you can go for this, then you creating a folder. Creating a folder by giving a names. Already untitled folder is there. Just by creating names, they added a folder. Then you can do this. What are the article you want to searching by the author names? LEV means you made the full article get displayed among the 
my libraries my libraries what are the documents that has been added only will get displayed just press it and select it and post it over here and we can find it in the add it to the folder this is a simple method by adding it the next thing i will can highlight the any pdf format or document which has been uploaded in the site so here you can use it select the articles in the top you can see about the pan note highlight color zoom zoom to fit sync etc if you want to select means by clicking this you can find out as a want a full paragraph or page or a selected text these things you can select and you can give a color also by selecting a color what color you preferred that color can be given as a background color so selection has been identified as you know about our about is zoom plus minus means zoom in zoom out the fit means to the system screen and as uh, after completion of this i have to select this sync synchronizing so once it is synchronized the whole thing will get synchronized and will get into the whole file so here it has been added or is updated properly okay so when you want to scrap i pull it into it and i can scrap it by uh, by pressing a mouse and i can deliver to this document has been inserted in the manly here we are inserting the document i here we have found is inserted you can see this there is a article delivery there has been uh, gone through is uh, referred and quoted all those things and has been pulled out here and have been inserted into the document so my document has been inserted the next day adding documents in a separate folder so in the top there is over the folder is there and uh, two things are there so watch folder and add entry manually you can do it manually also or you can add uh, automatically you can make as synchronizing by the system itself and we are going for this manual addition so you, you can find this manually the manually the logo is there by addition of this selection you can find out whether the files are in the library or not these are the files what are the pdf files has been present in the your my library systems manual entry we are going for this selection of folder and manual entry and selecting this uh, statue and you can go for this and you can whether it's a bill or book book selection case all the things can be typed over here in the case of the journal means once uploaded they'll give us a full abstract a tag a keyword etc if you want you can save it or you can go for this cancellation and the second one is we can uh, if you have in a different site yeah that may be you may prepare as end note or uh, research information systems in rls format so what are format is we can make it as a import or export so importing means we have been prepared in a end note format but you want to convert it into a manly means you can import and or you want to export means this manly format can be exported into this bib text or end note or rs any whatever format you want to make it you can convert it by exporting method so by exporting the the software is very helpful for entering and it is easy to handle or operate or add in this bibliography or references and when well, once you completed this uh, manly desktop that is not sufficient for us because we are uh, type written the articles in the ms word so the plugin will helpful uh, support to uh, transform the content into this uh, as a citations here four things as we uh, taken care inserting the citations changing citation style merging the citations creating a bibliography or references are possible so i'll explain briefly about one by one within short time okay so first one is inserting and modification of citation so yeah, in that uh, word document you can find out this insert or uh, edit the citations are there the mainly mainly the top right will be there word document if you want to click it they'll comes over here this tools what are all tools are being available and in the case of references american ama style apa ca style whatever style you want you can select it based on more you want to select more styles you can select it more click the more styles Use this uh, number of styles what are available. So uh, almost uh, 200 uh, types of styles are available, and even you can download and we can add it into this uh, your system. So that whatever format you selected automatically will be changed their uh, own format according to that style. Okay, so uh, here citation has been incorporated, and the three the citation has been added. The three citation has been complete reference has been cited over here in the about document. So the, here above this you can type as the references. and in the text you can uh, submit to the uh, publisher and then you have to go manly group also you have this alt matrix the alt matrix is a score of the indicator of an article potential impact so this score means getting your work noticed when you can lead to more number of citations generally speaking uh, 20 or more number of alt matrix score is i mean then your article is uh, good in for citation number of citations good so this is a, just a tool 
to helpful to calculate the alchemetrics about the uh, quality of the journal i give the link over here for this manly where it run it tutorial it takes more time so just i'm skipping it by explaining the content next we'll go for the site you like so this is another most preferred online reference manager so freely available to the researchers across the world so it has been launched in 2004 so pioneer offering services of online reference managers so as a pdf organizer as like is manly only okay it has uh, some of the selective features easily stores references you find online from online you can uh, by use of this doi or indicator uh, search engine you can uh, select and put it in your reference management system then discover new articles and resources easy then gives automated article recommendations also is done by this method shares reference with your peers there also you can share you can share the data here also you can share the data find who is reading and what you are reading so what are the which article you are reading your peer people what article they are reading whether read read or not also can be noticed by checked by this methodologies stores and researches your pdf articles which are been placed over here these are the basic features which are available in this site like the desktop version i am showing the system so here also you have to download the site you like applications and you can have to download and run it in the system so the system managers okay so coming to the library they are selecting about us a library site you like as like same way to the, to the top right corner and they are selecting is site my site you like this is the library what are the articles has been present in our library okay so once you click the library this article has been there so you can uh, the, the other parameters also there you can go for unread articles authors tagging posting import export profiling series all these things can be done by as per our requirement okay so then uh, this post uh, site you like has been the top this has been encircled in the uh, circle note then here we go for this and find the articles so i selected uh, articles and i have been posting into this where i want to be added so then come to this adding a file and tagging in the case of here you can go for citation and footnotes and when you cite it and you can add a tag as per your wish if you want to add a cancer you can add it add a cancer and as a whatever area of research or you are doing you can put a tag so the easy identification of a component so uh, then uh, we are placing as priority priority i made read it i really want to read it what i want to give is i i already read it what are things you want give a priority so that it will get segmented separately as per the priority so uh, prioritized means you want to read means there will be always present the top when you want you can read it okay so the attachment browse Well, if you have a hard uh, soft copy of published article, you can scan it and attach it. Based on that, you can go for publications. So keep in your document. And finally, after filling all those things, you have to select this post article, which is at the bottom. And just click it. The document will be attached in your library. Next, we come to this uh, Zotero. So it's an another online uh, reference manager available from the 2006 onwards, and it's been a new media uh, jar machine. You know, see in the US. This is based on this web-based systems and the desktop of open access, uh, open source application in the reference management as well as PDF files. Basically, almost uh, all the five have similar type of activity only. So this uh, function of Zotero has been collecting. Collecting means grabbing your research with a single click. You can personal research assistant is helpful. You store anything relevant to the research work. You can organizing. It has never been easier to start out your research. Say so go back to the folders in the internet and place it. tag it attach it easily site you are never uh, more than a click away from the bibliography site perfectly as you like it. always you prefer whatever style is made to be placed or prepared by the instruction to authors you can prepare it synchronization is very easy wherever you go for research everywhere painless data transfer has been done collaborative with the work together and share it to the world people who are working in the same environment uh, so so to have this number of advantages over the other things so you give this a basic website you have to download it from the website and uh, then you have to run it so uh, as i said it has been classified as uh, totally three segments the red coded things are called as uh, my library sections uh, what are the publications are there my publications whether to duplicated unfiled whether not used and uh, bin is there i mean uh, what are been sent to tra trash we can review and you can check it out the middle segment is called about as list of references the where as you said is welcome to zotero this area uh, where the concept is shown 
they are being say about us list of references as is seen in the previous case all the references list will be seen the last one is uh, say about us uh, selected references what are the details uh, our specific details have been present um, in this particular column as about us is the identification of article so when you go for identification article just selecting and by uh, clicking over this this uh, files by search is there no this search icon we can uh, find it easily i am selecting the article is there a review of uh, cause of cancer has been incorporated over here so i can give the title of the area what area you want you want to type by directly by typing the content here you can type it this is a import area where uh, re relevant to the article has been present over here and i want to uh, add a reference by selection of this i want to uh, in the my library you can add book book section document journal article newspaper article uh, link a file whatever things you want you can add it as a books by typing the data what are been required you can just add into this reference segment and in the case of this online search by selecting this isbn number doi if a doi number is there been just copy and paste it here select it automatically be there article will be added to your library simple method and as channel notes you want to write type it based on selection of notes and specific notes means added over here it will be easy for it then attach uh, files Where we want to attach the PDF files is available, or if it is only in the website, means you can attach this website as it is. And this is a search path where you can find your unknown article. Want to be searched in a different place in the reference management system? Is you can type it over here, and you can add it easily. And in the case of reference addition, the references can be added three methods by manually with an identifier using Zotero connection. The manually means it. Just a historical review of cause of cancer. Just taken as example, the Clark Brain author is there. So you can type this Clark Brain author by opening the article separately, and this segment you have to type it there. Automatically, this will be get added over here. It's a review of cause. So the next is same article. We are adding by this identifier. So it's a DOI number or PMID number. So this number has been copied and pasted over here. So what happens? Directly as we uh, once you select and paste it over here, uh, then uh, automatically the full details of the journals has been displayed in the column. So we can uh, find out uh, okay, there have been toys has been added. The next uh, with a web page by search engine, so we are uh, this uh, text we can able to see is full text is available. Okay, then uh, this is second one is based on the PubMed entry, uh, PubMed ID based on the PubMed ID we have been uh, loaded it. And web page means by based on web page we can select it, search the same article, and by this uh, full viewing these things, and uh, there in the top right corner we can click it and saving to my library. So these things, uh, so the same one. Why is uh, shown this means the three same articles has been added by three different methodologies in the library, and here you can find us the three articles has been there. So this plus this uh, symbol is indicate that there has been attachments PDF has been there. Only the website they do not have PDF format. In the case of online searching or manual entry, the PDF has been has been attached. By selecting this, we can find out the data of this information of this particular article. Then we type all the details has been present over here. Then we already know about the three articles are there. So we know about this is duplications. So we want to remove this duplicate files. So we have to go for this duplicate items which is present in the left side column by selecting duplicate items. Yeah, it has been displayed. This all the three has been displayed, and we can go for the merging. So merging the three items. So according to the date and time. So usually what we will do the latest one. We will have the confidence on particular area. We select it and just send enter. Then automatically this all the duplicate files will get removed. Coming to single file will be present over there. And always in collecting collection of the references. Here, uh, this uh, same article has been published over here, and if any else, I uh, want to make it as a, uh, a cancer-relevant article, separate folder means, and the collections can be done. The my library, you can go for this, uh, created a separate folder. The second thing, find this uh, my library has been created a separate uh, cancer literature review. So cancer literature review has been there. So from this, we are uh, pressing, uh, selecting the article and pull it and uh, place it here. The same article has been selected to this cancer literature library. So, what are the articles in relevant area? What do you feel? 
we can put it in the saying uh, as a single category, single folder, all the reference has been placed. And if you want to uh, place sub uh, files, sub folder, you can do it. In case here, uh, cancer uh, literature review has been there. You want to add a separate file, new uh, sub collection. We click the sub collection, want to make an introduction and enter it. Separate file introduction will be comes over this. So you can see this introduction as a, um, under the my library. My library, the major is the cancer literature review. Above bottom of it, introduction has been present. Okay, so these are the key tagging key are there. So based on the tag, and you want to make a color or code also. So as I said earlier, you want to say change the color. What type of color you would like to have? I said a red in color, just to make it as a color of red. So color code can be given. Uh, red, blue, green means based on the color, you can be able to easily identify it. Okay, this color means okay, this type of uh, activity. Means you need to uh, finding a searching a name, all those things. It's easy to identification. Then adding this related uh, references. So the related references, where the top right is there, adding. So what are the relevant uh, references? What are the color code given here? Is the red. So we can know what is. This is the cancer literature review of the selected one by given the color code for identification purpose only. Then you go for this adding the notes. So you can see this in the top. One by one, I have been covering these things. Information, notes, tag, and the related documents. Then this, uh, after this, notes. Notes, I can give this separately. I think I give this CTLA uh, for review. For review means review journal articles you plan to write. It. So the, what are the research articles you, you collected or you, you performed, published, you have been combined and separated placing as notes. So easily you can cross-check it and uh, all the articles can be relevant and things can be is it verified and before going for this publication or writing this specific review articles. As I guess the earlier case, here also it completed as Zotero and you had to convert this using the plugin, you had to use it in the word where they typed all the articles. So Zotero, when you go for the top, so these things will be available in the top man desktop and the word document file things, Zotero is there. When you select this, this box will get displayed. And if it is not displayed, then you can go for the site is there, means the way references. And you can select this, reinstall Microsoft Word add-in means, then automatically comes added over here. Simple. Then afterwards, by selecting this Zotero, then you can guess uh, what type of uh, methodology you want to adapt it, citing the reference, what format. These things can be selected and just plus OK. They'll go, get into added over here. Then reference means if you want to add a Zotero, is it a logo of this is Zotero, this is that you want to type a naming of it, the same thing will get displayed over here and it can be added over here. The easy reference. So this is citations. This reference, what I previously shown here, the programmed cell death protein, the where you can say is PD1, say what is the references, Han et al. 2020. Simply the reference has been by entering it, the reference has been added over here. So this thing can be given the added to the library also. So library by adding this, what format you want. Uh, American so, uh, APA model means of seventh edition format. You can select it and just press OK. And if you want, to, you can select this field bookmarks. If you're requiring required, then you can select it. Otherwise, just press OK. It will be added or this. Then next, we go for this edition or addition of this citation style. So this PD has been the present over here. You want to make a different style, and you can select it by prefer select this uh, preferences. The preference means uh, this style will be opened. So what type of journal you want to select it? You can select any one and select OK. Then automatically the citation style will get changed as per it. If you want to go for this additional styles, uh, what are the maybe the 20 uh, models or uh, journals will be listed over here. If you want addition style, you can select the uh, addition styles by selecting the top one. And you have a number of things are there. So uh, what are the ACM itself? You have a number of citation models. Uh, it depends upon the journals, specific journals. If you want, you can select it and it will open a bibliography format and you can view it if it is right. OK means you can save it and you can attach to your system. So whatever the format is, it automatically be reformed and you can add it to the reference sections. Then coming to the Google Scholar Library. So it's launched on the 19th November and is later only been changed to Google Scholar. Later it will be in the Google Scholar Library. And citations be available for the free access for researchers throughout the world. Here, some uh, personal collections are there. My library, my citations are cited by me. And also, I can be seen by this. What are the pros and cons of this Google Scholar? 
So index information, just about anything can be done over here. Uh, different kinds of sources of uh, types can be included over here. And uh, it's a great place to start easily without any uh, discomfort. And the concept, peer reviewed articles are not guaranteed. And uh, different kinds of sources available. So all the sources, because of, uh, uh, we know what is indexing. Indexing in else, uh, elsewhere, spring, uh, journaling, and uh, chemical index, uh, chemical abstracts, RSS, PubMed, and uh, so these are uh, all different kinds of sources. If the journals are indexed in uh, Google Scholar, then only really we can able to identify and uh, retrieve it easily as it is like. Otherwise, if it is not indexed in Google Scholar, we will, it is difficult to add the reference. What do you do? You have to do it by manually. Otherwise, automatically that uh, Google Scholar itself will find the journals and store it easily. And uh, one more thing, it takes much time because uh, if you may publish a journal or publish an article in a journal by month of September, what happens is they may not index it immediately. You may, they may send you a published article and indexing will not be done immediately. They may take a, do it, maybe some journals may do it within a week or month or sometimes may happen to three months or six months or one year. So if it takes one year, after one year only, that article will be available in the online. So the citation indexing will be difficult for the case unless service if it is indexed by the google scholar because only it's an online source that's the drawback okay all the say, saved articles will be available here so if you want to cite my, my cited or my library means what are the articles has been presented you can find all the articles over here okay and if you want to select it in a google uh, details or record the google scholar library you can find out this my uh, library and a uh, valuation matrix of this so you can select it by the star. I'll show it later. And uh, the Google Scholar has the advantage of it by recognizing the sentence. So uh, once you're typing, uh, trying to type a word, it automatically shows us whatever you are searching for this segment area gives a title. If you click it, the relevant area will be displayed immediately. And uh, here you can find a uh, star is there. <coughs> a little good. This cited by uh, 228 means this article has been cited by 208 people and in the citations have been in 96 uh, and this star is you can able to select it so, so just selecting it you can, uh, can transfer to your library so this will say this recognition of your article how far it has been cited and if you have published an article they saying is related articles if you click this related articles if relevant to this work uh, of articles you get opened in the same Google means website. So that is the advantage of it. And if you want to go for this, uh, select you or custom or advanced search, and you can go for this, uh, advanced search over here. Google Scholar has been present, advanced search left side, the column. And once it is this window will open, uh, select the typing as a uh, health outcome. Anywhere in the article means you'll find out uh, anywhere in the any article it says uh, statement of a uh, health outcome means then it will be uh, the, that article will get uh, uploaded or opened. If you are, and among the health outcome articles, you want to put a specifically health word is to be necessary means and at least one word health means we can type in a one extra phrase. One word will be there is that article. So likewise, we can give conditions from which year to which year and authored by the who, which person. All the relevant things can be get selected easily by our convenient. And we can find out this article list. Whatever the star we want to selected, no. All these things comes under the range. And here you can say about it. You can find the range of since 2020, 19, 16, custom range. If you want to change it 2015 to 2020, you can select it as per our convenient. Okay, by this, you can find us the article list. Where from the this is a HTML source, these are PDF available. So we can find out according to based on this thing whether it is only online source or PDF source available. If it is a PDF source, means you can click it and you can download as a PDF format. And you can find out this uh, citations are impact. And uh, you can find out this, uh, see, cited by 21. I said earlier, so, by, uh, so this is be 21 people have been cited this article. Maybe self citation also may be uh, incorporated, included over here. So these things can be identified by easy identifications. So by selecting this, opening a link. So uh, we are select it and by checking out this, by selecting the title and by which science it is. 
So you find out this uh, same article in Weber Science it is present. So you select this Weber Science and you can find out this. where the article has been got published. So indexed in Weber Science, you can find out the particular article and the relevant details has been opened as a link. So the so these things are been available easily and finding them by uh, convenient in the Google Scholar. And if you want to buy, search your article, so same web of things. So web of things, you want to search the article. The article can be selected. And if you want to download, you can download the article full by full site. So this particular article has been uh, cited by this 13 times has been cited. Total is 130. So you can find out this. What are things the same uh, health word? So we use the word now. I'll show it once again. Health outcome. The health outcome has been quoted over here. Hello, where are the health outcomes are there? So this 130 times has been cited over here. So you can go for other source of citations, the number. So cited 21 in the Google, other means other source of citation has been present over here. And if you want to check out this, this I mean, what are the different citation methodology the, the article has been published? A cited means, let's say it was a MLM R method, APA method. So all this methodology has been adopted. And these three methodology also has been adopted for the publication methods has been there. So this article has been published in different style, different journals. You can able to view it in an easy manner. And said in the, for the future viewed in my library, what are things has been, uh, you feel that this article is important. Then you can make a select the star. Just click by click, you can select the star and automatically the, this will be viewed in the uh, file. Your uh, articles in your library will be selected. And uh, you can find out this, my selection of this and uh, how far I've been uh, present in this count research and number of results has been founded. How far uh, in this you can uh, create each and individual uh, list also can be selected and opened and uh, created. So that uh, list uh, you can open either 10 articles or 10, uh, 20 articles or 20 results can be published or viewed can be done. We can use uh, or view easily as per convenient. Last one we go over is EndNote. So EndNote is a basic well-known property, the reference management tool. I mean, uh, well established in the year 2006 and developed by Thomson Reuters. And uh, this has been called as EndNote Basic, which is available to researchers across the world. And in the case of institutions or universities, uh, you have the academic uh, login, email ID. You can use it as a free of cost. Uh, that is the advantage, most advantage of this EndNote Basic. Institution login is there, you can use it as a note as a free uh, software. E that this also have multi multiple options, easily uh, use it. So, this uh, basically have this gather biography, bibliography information using book marklet from articles or electronic journals uh, for your personal library. I will use it in the account. Comparison between this EndNote basic and the full version. So, uh, only up to 50,000 references only can be used in basic. 20 most popular bibliography styles are available. 2 GB uh, file storage. Online search for this most uh, five popular database only available. Web page references can be captured. Uh, and uh, coming to the full version, you have been a price. You should be paid. So, but uh, what is this? Unlimited reference storage. Here restricted 50,000 references. But as a, a case of resources, we may not have more than 50,000. So we can use the end node basic itself as sufficient for us. And once you complete the work, uh, and you can areas over means they can fit out all things. You can refresh and remote, and you can freshly can uh, add uh, all those things in the library also. So, if, uh, case of price paying system, 5GB file storage is available. Uh, so, the remaining things all are been almost similar. What are things other additional properties are available? Automatic reference updating, automatic search PDF, complex bibliography handling methods, composite references, abbreviation, recognition, and standardization are available. And here, collection organization and formatting. So based on other things, searching through online database, creating a reference manually, import the references from the other database is easy. Collection of methods. Organizing by creating new groups, shares within the group, finding a duplicate reference and remove it. The formatting, either by format bibliography, here you want to cite you as you write a plug using the word plugin and the format a paper. So all these things are optionally possible. So home, this is the home page basic and the other one is called about us, uh, in order this sign in. So uh, in case of what is a uh, new capture using this bookmark letter, this is the Emerald system which has been adopted over here for the usages. And coming to the premium, 
they will give us a paid version how is a like upgrade basic check you get this n note basic one you can upgrade by this here for this 124 dollar two part is depends upon the there will be change time by time otherwise you can want to use it in the full trial version you can use a free trial version for only for 30 days uh, 30 days you can use this in n number of citations references to you know lakhs of references also can be added uh, but 30 days try, once completion they will be charging will deduct the money from your credit card so if you want to use a free trial you can use it and after completion of the particular work within a one week or two weeks you should exit and you should close it otherwise the amount will be deducted from your credit card default okay so you should keep in those things in the mind and doing this uh, we are checking this trial version trial version means they immediately they'll ask the credit card details and the otp will comes so uh, default within if you forget it and when a stipulated period of time comes automatically the amount will be deducted from your library so from the credit card so uh, here also you can go for this opening uh, creating a library you can want you can open uh, creating a new library means like new library if you want doing it a fresh one you yeah, here also you can download the note and you can install it create a new library so you can new, new library give us a sevens we can give a name and automatically stored in this end note so here also you can have this uh, four sections uh, left is says uh, all references uh, folders uh, my uh, unfilled uh, recently added uh, duplicates all the things are present here middle list of references are quick search all the references will get listed over here right will gives us information of the selected references what reference is selected by that details of particular reference only be shown in the right side the top will gives us additional options what i want you can do it a modification can be done so as like as the previous one you can do the addition of this article by manually online down the reference file by using end note click so when you open this end note again by selecting this pressing this plus plus symbol and you can add it so you can add as open the word file pdf file which you have seen in the online and what are the data so author names year title journal volume all these things once it is selected this article will get added over here so you can add it as clark and you found it as clark bringing article has been added over here and i have been saved here okay so this i have been attached file details have been shown over here when you go for this online search you can go for this online search same thing has been selected over here and uh, you find out this online search names authors kind of year and uh, just a few data is sufficient just by clicking the uh, search you can get this uh, full details you start a review of this and so so the same thing is uh, here also it added as attached as a pdf the next we go for this online search then i added this library and then we want to uh, find a reference file and you go for the send it selection of the send it by a clipboard a bibliography a collections or citation managers you want you can select this citation this uh, indicates it has been uh, added in the end note this file has been uh, available in this end note file so easily can be added and collection can be done so file creations so the pubmed series we want to select it uh, by clicking this the top one and download the, the file has been got downloaded and selecting this attach the file the file has been created over here so imported by this important references can be added here so this is end note the same research article and once it, uh, the article has been seen in the pubmed if you click this view pdf in uh, en means end note if you clicked it the journal has been opened world journal of clinical oncology this historical review of the cause of cancer has been published once click this the journal article has been completely open then you can download the pdf if you want you can download a pdf and export the end note means it will get exported to the end note and you can add it so this is easy method so by clicking this you can add it so uploading the data it has been got uploaded directly into the reference management system and here also you can find this duplicates because i added the same file repeatedly by three methods so if you want to keep the record which record you want to keep it you can select the keep the record or remove record means if you keep the out of these four things you can select one and keep record means the other three will get removed from the library only which are selected only being there the next one comes the groups i mean if you want to create a group groups the top foot additional option is there the group is a create a group and i want to create a group group create a smart group means smart group smart group what is the difference between creating group and smart group means grouping means for doing by manually 
small group means by online what if for example cancer relevant area what selected means automatically all the things relevant area wherever the articles got published in the research area will add it together or based on the author name is the author name what are the articles has been published and those articles will be added by the in a smart group that is called a smart group and the manual group means we have to add it by manually by single click only and after that is creating a group and then you have to add to the references we we created a group of introduction and we want to press article as we shifted to this references just press select it and the add to the references will be added to the journals so the uh, and next we come to this unfilled so the out of these articles the unfilled articles can be removed five earlier uh, seven references are there in the first image second image given is only unfilled is five is, uh, five references so means out of seven references two references has been added five are is unfilled so these unfilled articles can either you want to uh, send it to trash or you can give any uh, selective name and again store it for the future work and uh, the you can create as subgroup as like a subclass group here as introduction that you can give this subgroup and you uh, add this articles as selected journals in a selective groups so that they can use it frequently as per their convenience and if you want uh, creating a group or deleting group the subgroup you can group is subgroup i want to delete you can delete the group as it is so once i remove this the complete group will get uh, removed from this so then uh, coming to uh, plugins the ms word you can find it as the intro 20th uh, right side top corner okay after the help just you click it the uh, this box tool box will come open it so uh, go to intro uh, manage uh, citations edit library references so uh, edit and manage citations means we can uh, add any one uh, the references can be cited uh, properly and the references means reference can be cited insert citation you can uh, select it and go for references uh, add it so the reference will get added over your site as a citations for example inserting a citation select this article and uh, click entering this uh, adding the references so automatically the reference has been cited in the text so easily just a single click you can add it over here and uh, you know, i want to change the other format so if you want to change the apa format or you want to this author and date format vancouver style whatever style just select it and go for this uh, style change the style automatically the format will get changed so that is the easy method so whatever style you want you can change the style and select okay that's all and change the output style you want to change the output style in format different format and you want to change the output style the different formats that will be available in the site so uh, what are the basis of the journals as like is manly here also you can uh, select this download whatever article you want for example journal of nutrition means the format has been given just uh, click it the article get downloaded the format by clicking the download the, you can able to uh, add directly and you can uh, upload it in the uh, then uh, for that journal you can separately can give, create a folder so it is easy for you for a particular journal the citation style will be uniform and easily can do it conveniently and uh, saving the format the setting the word and whatever things are uh, cited and you can setting the save the format the format has to be saved as a save, save as in a separate format or it means you want to make a different format and in the means the format has to be downloaded and you should select it and save us in a separate file indexing in this third instant uh, turning off or configuring whatever you want you can select it based on it will get selected as set it in the word documents and you want to add uh, updating you want to update means update uh, after typing all the things in the update citation bibliography you click it once all the uh, references will get updated and then you are converting in the into the text uh, for plain text we can see want all the references you know, at the bottom of the uh, text uh, so if you once you select this convert to plain text the references will be there that uh, text and uh, all the references will be presented at the bottom of the article the above this you can type the references word then you can send to this journal you need not worry about it all the article whatever things you have typed add it properly the uh, nothing issue will be there the perfectly they will be transformed uh, clearly and you can without any hesitation you can send to the journal references will not be an issue unless there is text or content or grammatical changes or errors uh, only have to update uh, check it properly and even for the plagiarism also you have to check it properly before submitting the articles the things i given this link 
If you want, you can just select it. Means you can find the articles of it. What other things are there in known classes? Just say given this model format only. Okay, if I look at compare the citation tools, we have said as five different things. Each and every tool have its own feature and its unique strength. So, in case of Manly, is a reference management tool that allows users to organize, annotate, share their research papers. And similarly, the EndNote and Zotero also have this because they have this open research reference management tools. And in case of Manly, it provides a desktop application as well as online synchronizations, make it easy. Uh, and this manly is a social networking component, allowing users to connect with other researchers and collaborate on a new research project. It offers automated uh, citation generations and supports variations uh, citation styles. And it also includes the PDF annotation tools, enables and highlight the taking notes within the documents. What are things uh, what we discussed earlier? Just saying making a comparison and uh, giving a thing. Or it's similar it's already times up, so just I'll give a concluding very shortly. And overall, the choice between the citation tools depends on your specific requirements. If you need comprehensive reference management with advanced features, Manly, EndNote, and Zotero may be the more suitable for the things, except this Google Scholar and their thing. And, and cite you like this, except these two things are the best one. The other, other hand, if you prefer a more social and collaborative approach, cite like might be the worth enough for the consideration. And in case Google Scholar can be valuable research for searching and discovering scholarly articles. But may lack of the full range of features for provided with the dedicated reference management tools. If you want to add it, if, uh, Google Scholar is free, so you can uh, collect the articles and then export into the Manly. Use it. So mergely you can use it for this. Enjoy the thing for this publications. Okay. <coughs> so these are the links. Just like given this uh, YouTube, you can just use, uh, type it in the Google website. YouTube uh, Manly means you can give, get a number of tutorials. And you can uh, just check it out. Uh, give any glimpses only. With this, uh, we can uh, operate and we can install. Unless otherwise you don't have a hands-on training and experience, uh, it's uh, very difficult to operate any tool. Once you go for publications, uh, better you can uh, check it out and uh, try. Or maybe you may initially may have a struggle. I mean, they help a uh, tool. You try and update it. Once you confirm it, then uh, first publications may take a few days. And comparatively typing all the references is easy to uh, alert it. And uh, once it got an idea, then uh, further references or all, whatever articles it is, simply for one journal is uh, rejecting, you can make it simply uh, changing by the other articles, by reference management tools, and you can convert easily for submission further. So that will be uh, helpful for the researchers, especially for the growing stage. Initial stage means it is easy. And the retainment stage means you find it difficult to correlate. So then we, by the way, it will depend on others. Try to when you initial stage people better as a students or researchers try to learn and you can adapt it, which are easy, a free of cost. Enjoy this thing for the publications. Okay. By this, I am concluding my presentation. Thank you. Thank you, sir, for such an uh, uh, enlightening and comprehensive presentation. Uh, you. Your insights have certainly given us a lot to think about implementing our research and teaching practices. Uh, before we wrap up today's session, if anyone has any questions for a uh, speaker, please feel uh, uh, to drop them in the chat box or raise your uh, hand now. If you have any questions, you can please type that in the chat box. Or please raise the hand, a virtual hand, like I can uh, unmute you. Okay. Is there any requirement? I found it. Is there any requirement for MS Word? Please, manually. So, manually also, whatever you are preparing, manually, desktop. Option is there, install it, add it. Then the plugins are there. 
just you, uh, by using manually desktop plugins you can uh, directly add the text references in the word document so it is easy for you once try to operate it is very simple thing is manually nothing required just uh, old version 2013 version at 9 also will support you no problem Okay. Okay, sir. That concludes our question and answer session, sir. Okay, thank you so much, sir. Uh, I actually thank you for your thank active, you for your active participation. Morning, we could not able to complete it on time, sir. Thank you, 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 sir.